Greetings. This is an instructional video on how to pick your nose. But first, before I start uh, going over the hows of picking your nose, it's important to know why you should pick your nose. Picking your nose is an exercise, nay, a meditation in humility. For those of you that think you're too good for everyone else, or too good to pick your nose, or uh, are stuck up in general, this is definitely a video for you. You should definitely learn how to pick your nose, and in public if necessary. But picking your nose also serves another function. It's functional. Sometimes there are boogers in your nose that are crusty and stuck in there, and you can't get them with a the Kleenex. So going at them with your finger is very important. All right, now on to how to pick your nose. Don't dig right into it. That's a beginner's mistake. First, you need to choose which hand you're going to do it with. I recommend you use the same hand that you do your writing with. I use my right hand. But that's not all you need. You need to use uh, decide which finger. What finger should I use? I recommend the index finger. It's got the most touch receptors and can locate the offending booger with the best of ease. But don't just stick that finger up there, no. First you need to inspect the finger. Make sure that the fingernail is not too sharp and too dirty. If it's too sharp, you will get a nosebleed in public. And then people will point and laugh and go, oh, you're a booger picker, I can tell because you've got a nosebleed. Make sure your nail is not too sharp. My fingernail is not too sharp. So, we've got the right hand, we've got the right finger. Now, you have to figure out which nostril. You should figure out which nostril to pick by uh, wriggling your nose around. And if you can feel a hard booger in there, then that's probably the nostril you should use. I am a very humble person, and so my nose is pretty much all cleared out already. But, for the sake of uh, instruction, I'll pretend that there's a big booger in my right nostril. So I take my index finger in my right hand, which is the one I'm most comfortable using, and I stick my finger in my nose. Now, you can't always get the booger right away on the first try. You have to move your finger around, and in fact, I've found that by opening my mouth real wide, I can stretch that nasal area better and get better access. So it ends up looking like this. Oh, there we go. And then, once you've got the booger firmly underneath your fingernail, you gently scoop, and there you have it. You should examine said booger first. It's always good to examine your booger I don't know why, but that's just how it's done. Now what you do with this booger is entirely up to you. And I'll leave you with the mystery on what was done with the booger. You should practice this in front of the mirror, maybe, or in front of friends, because they will definitely tell you if you're doing it right or not. Thank you. This has been an instructional video on how to pick your nose.